Hey guys, Shay Carl here. GE sent me all over the country as part of their Eco Imagination program to check out cool new green technologies. Right now, I'm in Madison, Wisconsin to check out an engine that runs off of cow poop and powers 2,500 homes. Let's go! go. Shay Carl, traveling the USA. Right here at the Dane County Community Biogas Energy Project. There's three different farms here. Let's go check them out and see what they do. I'm here! Woo! And I'm Shay. Hey Shay, I'm Carl. Welcome to Wisconsin. Carl? Dan. Dan, nice to meet you. This is where you make cow poop into light bulbs. Electricity, actually. Electricity. Uh, what we do is we take manure from three local farms, run it through a digester, we capture that energy in biogas and use that for fuel for the uh, Yenbacher engine. All right, well, why don't you guys show me around? Let's try to break some stuff. This is our receiving building, so when a farmer wants to truck in some manure, this is where he brings it and drops it off to us. That's a big steaming pile of shit. That's exactly what this is. <laughs> On any given day, we process about 100,000 gallons of manure total. It's steamy poop. It's the potential, that's, that's the energy. That's it's the like, energy. It's, it's waiting, just, you can tell, yeah. It wants to be made into electricity. Yeah. The only way to get to know a pile of manure is to climb on top of it. Here we go. Mom, look at me. I always told you I would make it to the top. I am the master of the poo poo. We are standing upon cow poop that powers an engine that is powering homes. So take that, unrefillable resources. We don't need you anymore. We got cows. This is Todd Andrus right here in his barn, and he has how many cow here? 200? 220 in this facility. This is where it starts. It goes in one of their 800 stomachs, comes out the other end, pump it over there, and then it turns into energy. Yep. So each one of you is powering a house. Looks like you saved the ugliest ones for the end. Bunch of big, fat, stinking animals. Ugh, gross. Oh no, oh no, Cal has my baby. I will save the day. I have a wipe. Now everything's better. Everything's better. Oh, that is a deep, rich fudge. Oh man, just give me a second. I just think I saw a big gator swim in there. So you got some huge tanks here. Yep, these are the digesters. This is about 1.3 million gallons. Papa yoy. So as the manure is mixed inside the tank and heated, all the biogas will rise and gets captured in the top of the tank. So right now all these tanks are full of biogas. So biogas is mainly methane, and the biogas is produced from the breakdown. Those microbes break down the organic waste and those bacteria are what create the biogas. Wait, wait, wait a minute. So you're saying we're standing on top of green technology. That's right, people. Green technology is here and now. It's not a thing of the future. All right, so, so this is the machine. It's the Janbacher engine, and this is what creates the energy. Exactly. It's a spark-ignited engine. How many pistons are in it? This is a V20, so it's, there's 20 V20. cylinders. V20. So as that engine is consuming the biogas, it's turning the generator. So our 1,000 kilowatts is going directly out to the grid. Well, 1,000 <laughs> kilowatts should do it. It's the Janbacher engine running off of biogas that was created from the poop of cows. It's removable energy. <laughs> <sighs> you wanna go grab a burger? Yeah, let's go. Let's get a burger. Remember, GE wants you to tag your green, so go to facebook.com slash ecoimagination and add yourself to the Tag Your Green map, and I could be coming to visit you. Tag your green, yeah.